Hi, I'm Sharon Peterson, AKA Little Miss Red. This week's wine adventure has brought me to the Twin Cities here in Minneapolis, where we get to hang out today with Minneapolis' very own Iron Chef, Same Wadi. There's gonna be food, wine, and as always, lots of fun. So let's go. Let's go. It is said that treasures are found in the least likely places, and such is the case of the Saffron Restaurant and Lounge. Situated in the heart of Minneapolis's warehouse district, Saffron has opened the eyes of the Twin Cities and captured the attention of foodies worldwide. This oasis, created by brothers Same and Saeed Wadi, fuses exquisite decor with their native Middle Eastern cuisine. Sami's dishes are known for their amazing depth of flavor and are creatively balanced with a simple, approachable style, much like the chef himself. Oh gosh, this is so good, thank you. Yeah, absolutely. So, tell me, I have to know, how did you know you wanted to be a chef? My mom and my dad, growing up, they started um, writing a cookbook, and it was about preserving Palestinian and Middle Eastern cuisine. I developed a little bit of a, a sensitive palate from a very young age mm. um, where I would critique my mom's food and say, this has a little bit too much cumin in it. Stop or, it. Yeah, yeah. Did it make her mad? <laughs> a little bit. So one time she went to the spice monger and got um, different spices. And she got cumin and she got uh, something else. I forget what it was now. But uh, the guy mislabeled the cumin with the all, yeah, the mixed spices, and then he wrote about the mixed spices that it's cumin. And I tasted it and I said, this doesn't taste right. This, there's something wrong. And, you know, I, I gotta remind you, I was seven years old. You were seven? Seven years A old. super taster at seven. <laughs> yeah. And so, what was it like, now I'm gonna talk Food Network stuff. Oh, God. Just very briefly, I know of you're course. burned out on it. Okay, so they called you. You didn't call them, right? So you get this call, and what were you thinking? How did that play out? So I wasn't at the restaurant okay. when, when they called. They called and they spoke to my brother, Said, um, and I was out getting some stuff uh, for the restaurant and he called me on my cell phone and I was mm -hmm. having a really, really bad day. Oh. So uh, he calls and says, hey, Food Network called. <laughs> and I said, what, do we owe them money? Just pay them. <laughs> <laughs> Did you even believe him? <laughs> I'd be like, not. shut up, bud. Like, owe them money? Just, uh, just pay them, <laughs> <Did> man. <laughs> yeah, yeah. True what stuff. are your dreams and goals for this restaurant and for yourself? I would love to um, open up another outpost. Um, oh, would you? Not, not necessarily the same cuisine, but something a little bit different. Okay. Um, I have so many ideas in my head about food, and I just, I'm very limited here to what I get to do. I just get to do Middle Eastern Mediterranean food. Wow. Where I wanna, I wanna do more. Um, so maybe another restaurant or another venue of some sort. Yes. So you could explore. Yep. Your more, interest in more, that more worldly cuisine. Right. Uh, as well as I would love to publish the cookbook that my <gasps> mom and my dad started. <gasps> oh my gosh! I get chills. You have to do it. You have to <laughs> yeah. do it. Oh. That is something that um, definitely has been on the mind since I started cooking. <laughs> well, thank you so much for sitting down with me. It's been so nice talking to you. Thank you you're, so you're much. You're just amazing. And I'm not just saying that Brown knows you. You thank really, you. really are. Thank yeah. you. I truly really appreciate yeah. that. I absolutely appreciate yeah. it. Though. So I bet you're hungry now. I was just going to say, oh. I would love to taste one of your famous sandwiches, absolutely one of your lamb BLTs. Please. No. Where is he? Oh, come on, relax. <laughs> I got some lamb bacon for you. Yum. Yeah. Fry it up. So this is the uh, the house-cured lamb bacon. And we're just going to fry it up a little bit, and okay. then, uh, we'll make a BLT for you. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you, thank you. Cheers. Same to you. Woo. So you just... Uh, you want something, too? This woman. Does she work here? <laughs> I don't know. Can I? You're fired. <laughs> Bacon. Hey, hey! Oh. Come on! This is Sharon, this is by the way. This my lunch, guys! Oh, thank you! Really. Nice to meet you! I like you too. Can I have lunch with you? You can dance with me. Alright, what can I do? I have bacon, I can do that. <laughs> 